Students at Kane University recently took part in an unusual team exercise. They worked together to track down and collect Apple AirTags, one of the many GPS tracking devices people can now buy to locate things like keys. The aspect that I loved about it was the teamwork and I met so many new people in this event. I believe that's the most important part. But the event also had a serious purpose. There is concern oftentimes that, that people are stalking others and usually women are the target, unfortunately. Cybersecurity pro Scott Schober says he coordinated the event to help raise awareness about cyber stalking. The education part of this, educating students to understand how technology could be used for good, but also could be wrongfully used. Cyber stalking is a growing problem. A survey in Australia found one in four people who bought tracking devices there had a history of domestic violence. Here in the U.S., a congressional study found more than three million people report being stalked each year. And stalkers use technology to keep track of their victims more than 80% of the time. But protecting yourself from cyber stalking has also gotten easier in recent years. Experts say one of the biggest things you can do is pay attention to the alerts on your phone. If you get one saying an unknown device is traveling with you, don't ignore it. Those alerts are there to protect your safety and privacy. There are also tracking detection apps and even standalone devices that will let users scan for nearby air tags or other tracking devices. It's simply, it's like a key fob. You, you turn it on and what it does is it really just scans and looks for any tags that are in the area and instantly alerts you. And if you think your safety is at risk, Schober says, contact law enforcement right away. In your corner, Walt Kane, News 12.